All right, on this one, there's no parentheses, so there's no need for multiplying any of the exponents. And there's no division, so no need for subtraction either. We can reorganize this because it's all multiplication in here. So we'll use the commutative property of multiplication. 6 times 10 times x to the power of 3 times x to the power of 3 times y to the power of 5 times y to the power of 12. So 6 times 10 is 60. This would be x to the power of 3 plus 3, which is x to the power of 6. And y to the power of 5 plus 12 is 17. There we go. No negative exponents. And uh, that's good. So make sure you guys are showing some work on this. Some of you guys may not want to show what it, do it the way that I did. Some of you guys just may write 6 times 10 is 60 x to the power of 3 plus 3, and then y to the power of 5 plus 12. As long as I can see some work on the test, you'll be good.